Hey guys, I'm Pixel Dan, and this is a review of the Outer Spacemen Infinity Edition Series 3 and Deluxe Series 1 from Four Horsemen Designs. Not too long ago, I took a look at the Alpha Phase versions of these same characters, which were sort of like the early previews of these, but done in translucent colors. The Infinity Edition features the figures that are fully painted and are always my favorite OSM versions. Each figure comes in blister card packaging that does an amazing job of recapturing the look of the vintage card backs. The back of the packaging gives you some information on the character within, and even shows you an image of the carded vintage figure released by Colorforms back in the 60s. With the awesome spacey theme and the fantastic photos of the figures in action featured on the card back, the overall packaging is incredibly beautiful. And another thing that I've always loved about the packaging on Four Horsemen figures is that it is very collector friendly. You can slide the card back out and remove the figure for loose display, but this allows you to also easily place the figure back in his package if you'd prefer display him that way. But let's go ahead and get these figures out of the packaging and take a closer look at them. We'll start with a look at Gemini, the man from the Twin Star Algol. Gemini features an incredibly vibrant color scheme, with his body mostly being a bright yellow accented by black and red. His most defining feature is the two heads topped off with neon orange helmets. Like we've seen on all of the Outer Spacemen figures thus far, the space helmets are removable, exposing a metallic silver paint job on the cone-shaped heads beneath. <laughs> Bright yellow, neon orange, metallic silver, red, black... Talk about a wild selection of colors on this guy. But it works, in that wacky appeal of a vintage toy sort of a way. He includes two accessories, an orange ray gun and an orange staff. The staff is my favorite accessory on this guy, because sitting atop that is yet another domed head. The blue dome can even be removed from the staff to expose the same silver color used on all of the other heads. Next up is Orbitron, the man from Uranus. Just like his vintage counterpart, Orbitron is done in a very bright neon pink, accented by gold and copper colors. He features a long, lanky body with pinchers for hands and a beak-shaped mouth, and a large brain sticking out of the top of his head. Now, I always stress that one of my favorite aspects of the Outer Spaceman toy line is the total retro-futuristic look, and Orbitron here is a prime example of that. He looks like he walked right off the set of a 50 sci-fi movie. Like, really, he does. For accessories, Orbitron comes with a translucent pink ray gun and a star-shaped shield, both of which snap firmly into his pincher-like hands. And then we come to Cyclops, the giant from beyond the Milky Way. Cyclops is the first deluxe figure in the Four Horsemen's Outer Spacemen line. He stands a bit taller than all of the standard OSM figures, and is quite a bit bulkier as well. He features a really cool paint job, with armor of metallic gold, and skin that is a cool combination of metallic teal blue and purple. Now another thing that makes this figure a deluxe figure are all of the removable accessories that allow for different modes of display. He comes with two ray guns that have translucent orange caps on the end. You can have Cyclops hold onto the guns with both of his hands, or if you'd prefer, he can also holster them on his armor. He even comes with an extra set of open hands that you can swap out. These hands have a really great monster claw look, and I love how the palms feature that purple coloring. Just like all of the other figures, you can remove the space dome. Underneath, Cyclops is wearing another golden helmet. Now this helmet can also be removed, as can his golden armor. 
This reveals even more awesome detailing on his sculpt, and I just really love that awesome teal and purple color scheme that he sports. Now just like all of the other OSM action figures, these are all built on the Glio system, made famous by Onel Design. What that means is that the figures have the ability to pop apart at every joint, and are fully interchangeable with one another and all other Glios compatible action figures that are out there. This will allow you to mix and match parts to create your own wild and wacky aliens. Being a fan of the retro-futuristic sci-fi theme, I have really enjoyed Four Horsemen's Outer Space Men action figures. It's just so great seeing a classic toy line like this get brought back to life with so much love and care. This is yet another amazing set of aliens, with Cyclops probably now ranking as my all-time favorite of the entire bunch. And posing these guys with the rest of your Infinity Edition Outer Spaceman figures really shows the amazing collection that we are now able to build. Fans of space and sci-fi, Glios collectors, and fans of the Four Horsemen's work will all find something to really love about these figures. If you're interested, you can order them right now at www.storehorseman.com while supplies last. I'd highly recommend checking them out. Until next time... <laughs>